Back in December 2019, I believe I had the first unconfirmed case of the coronavirus. It was a Sunday. I was out looking at Tacomas or whatever. I was doing something. I just didn't feel good. Cleveland Browns were playing the um, Cincinnati Bengals. Browns season was over, so I'm out looking at vehicles. The game wasn't on TV. I don't think it was on TV that day or something. Whatever. It wasn't on TV. And I remember being sick. And I remember coming home, and I think the Browns won, obviously, put it Bengals. But I remember the next six days is, or five days as being fucking hell. I don't remember two of them days, Monday and uh, Sunday night and Monday. I don't remember at all. And, you know, I've had your normal flu, and it really never bothered me. But this one here got me good. First five days is hell. Or first three days is hell. Second three days is miserable. Then the next six to seven days, you're just fucking starting to try to feel better. But I had the first unconfirmed uh, case of coronavirus back in December. And uh, they gave me Tamiflu or something like that. I had a 102 temperature when I went in to see uh, the Minute Clinic. And at the time, they told me I had the flu. But I believe it was the coronavirus. I don't think they knew what it was at the time, but, you know. And that coronavirus, let me tell you what it does to you, from my experience with it. Usually I take medication that makes me feel biblical. Well, during this period of uh, coronavirus, first uh, six days, I didn't take any medication. And uh, the reason why was it, for some reason the coronavirus renders you to the point where you don't have the energy to go get your medication and you're like, you feel so bad. I don't know. I couldn't explain it. I had no desire to take it. I was just so sick. It just, it ruins you. And, I, you know, I'm going to tell you, man, it was fucking, and I know how I got the coronavirus and I was going to fuck, I was so fucking mad when I knew why I got it because I, I know how I fucking got it. I know how I fuck I got that motherfucker. That pissed me the fuck off. But, um. The coronavirus is uh, about 14 days. That's why they have a 14-day incubation, if you think about it. They're having people incubate themselves or, uh, for, you know, stay away from people for 14 days. I forget what they call that shit, uh, quarantine. And I remember it took about 14 days for everything to start tasting normal. Food, everything tasted like salt. It was terrible. Nothing tasted good. So my experience, like I say, again, my experience would have probably killed most people. But being, well, at the time, I was 6'2", about 220. Now I'm 6'2", 245, 250. But still, 220, it got me pretty good for six days. First six days, like I say, was bad. Then after that, um, the size of that hand. That's not even a broken one. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, you know, so it can be combated. You got to know how to. I don't think when I had it, I didn't eat. I had no desire to eat. Like I said, nothing tasted good. Everything was salty. I, I was eating a piece of pizza. It was like so I couldn't eat it. Everything tasted nasty. So you had what it is, you had no desire to do what you normally would do. So I had the first, I believe, unconfirmed case in the United States. At the time, no one knew what it was, but I knew what it was because I had the normal flu before and it never did this to me. And, uh, you know, the NBA closing up basketball. I can't think of anybody. It is what it is. No one cares. Um, so yeah, I had the first unconfirmed case of the coronavirus and my experience with it, this was first three days or hell. I don't remember from Sunday night, seven o'clock. I don't remember. I slept. This is the honest God truth. That following Monday, I slept from Sunday night until I don't even remember Monday at all. I don't remember it. I I remember vaguely trying to watch Brown's Red Zone at uh, 8 o'clock, and I, I don't remember nothing. I do remember during the time I'd stay up late watching a lot of Night Rider that was on Stars and uh, sleep all day. You sleep all, when you had the corona, you sleep a lot. You fucking sleep a lot. At least in my case, I did. In fact, I lived in this fucking... No, I didn't live in this living room. Oh, you know what? I remember. I don't even think I fed the cats. I was so fucking sick. But, yeah. So I was the uh, first unofficial, confirmed, unconfirmed case in the United States. But I'm going to, I'm going to, I diagnosed myself. I believe I had it. 